today we are going to be attempting to beat the new Stumble Guides map called Stumble Up. And you might be asking yourself, well, didn't you already beat it for one of your previous videos? The answer is sort of. Since the last video I made, they actually patched it so that you can fully complete it. And I was watching MTM Samu's video, whose link will be down below. But as you will notice, this is the part that we were able to get to in our last video. And this is the rest of the level. So as you will notice, there's a whole new path. So our job today is to not only get there, but see if we can beat it. Let's hop into the map. And here we go. As we try to complete this, we are also going to try to speed run at the same time. Since we know up until that point, we shouldn't have any trouble technically getting there. If we do everything as I remember, we should be fine. Not only do we have to worry about what we already know, there's no checkpoints at the new stuff either. So if we fall at any point, just like in normal, only up, we're going to have a problem. 29 seconds in and we're already uh, failing. For those that don't know for speed running, if you want to get the fastest possible time, you want to wait to use your dive towards when you are closer to the ground. So you're going to like delay it and do it like that because it takes less time to get back up onto your feet. Minute down and this is already slow. I can already tell. I think at the end of this video, we're going to react to someone's speed run. I don't know if anyone's done the full new part of the level, but we will credit whoever we react to at the end. When recording the last only up or the stumble up video, I was so tired. A lot of people were like, why didn't you rage? And I'm like, I just didn't have the energy for it. <laughs> but today, if we fall a lot, a lot, it's going to be bad. It's going to be a lot of bad news because as of recording this, I'm kind of in a rush because I am going to catch a flight tomorrow. Ooh, and I can't really speak about it because it kind of involves stumble guys. I don't want to give anything away, but then I will be going to uh, TwitchCon, which there will be stumble guys people there as well. If you're going to be at TwitchCon, be sure to say hello to me if you see me. I don't know how many of my viewers watch Twitch because most of you guys are on YouTube, but I used to stream every day on Twitch. I definitely enjoy making videos because then I am able to reach more of you guys. Because Twitch, it felt like you can talk to a, like people more personally, but you can't talk to too many people. <gasps> I need to stop talking. I need to stop talking. All right, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna start trying again. Why didn't it let me jump though? I literally was spamming jump. Was I literally one jump away from the pirate ship? This has been a blur already. I'm trying to be as fast as possible, all right? Obviously not doing a great job. And if I cared about being fast, why am I not going through there? These are the questions I should be asking. I'll make a deal to myself. I'm only going to speed run the parts that I don't fall at. So I want to at least get past this part and then we'll start jump diving again. Four minutes, 20 seconds, and we're to the blocks. The blocks aren't too bad as soon as you figure them out. Basically, once you get to this point, my favorite thing to do is just ignore it completely and go down to these bouncers. Now, don't overshoot or undershoot that dive there or you're in trouble. But once you're here, you can just go here and then to the block. Again, I haven't watched any speedrun strats, which I probably should have since this is kind of a speedrun video. I'm going to do my method since I know my method and it's obviously worked because... We, we, I've heard people really struggle with the map up until the part that we got to and like take hours to get there. For us, it only took us, what, 30 minutes? I forget the entire length of the video. So far, so good. I'm doing a whole lot of talking. I need to be more concentrated. Once this fully releases, I would love to see a streamer compilation of people raging at the game. Someone at Stumble Guys or Scopely should do that. Maybe I'll do it. If you recall from the previous video where we played this map, we got to this point at basically the same time, around six minutes. And it's very frustrating. But for us, we went this way. I've seen people go to the left. Again, we're just doing the way that we know. And since we've already done this part, I shouldn't be stressed. But in my head, I'm like, I'm going to fall. So don't fall and we'll be fine. Don't fall, we'll be fine. The biggest piece of advice is to make it easy on yourself and line up your camera so that you're straight. So you can just hold forward. Okay, there we go. I almost crapped myself. But we're to the now new portion of the map. Oh gosh, oh, I already know we're gonna fall. I already... So bask in its glory while we're here, right? Because the further we get, the uh, more tilted we are going to be <laughs> as soon as we fall. So now my question is, is oh yeah, this is slippery. So I'm going to give you a piece of advice as we do this. Wait, do we have to go fast? I'm just now realizing this. I haven't watched anything. 
But I'm just going to take a guess and say we got a sprint. If this is slippery, that means we just got to time it. Let's try it. Here we go. Come on. Please let me be right. Oh, no. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can do this first try. Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. Please, 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 please. Block, save me. Block, save me, please. Okay. Nope. <gasps> no. No. Okay. Thank God for those blocks. I have a new strategy, and that's to start on the... What would it be? The leftmost side. So you're going to probably have to start at the highest incline part. And then as you go across it, you're going to like slowly move down. No, 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 dude. No. Oh. If we can beat this in under 30 minutes, I would be ecstatic. I'm just going to say it. MTM Samu is better at this game than I am. And if he can't do it in 45 minutes... I don't know if I can do it in one setting either. If anyone knows who the first person to actually beat it is, huge shout out to them. It might be Samu. I don't know if he actually beat it yet. Now, again, line up the camera. Just going up it is kind of weird. Okay. Did you just see that? If I would have lagged off, I would have ended the video there. No, I'm joking. Whoever put this tree on this island, frick you. Frick you. If you're watching this video and you made this level, frick you, dude. Dude, if I, if I lost there, I would have broke my monitor. Okay, so like I was saying before, I think you have to start on this side and make your way that way. Should I watch a tutorial? See, I don't want the comments to get mad at me, but I also want to win. Oh, we're going for it. Whatever, whatever. Just stay towards the top. Stay towards the top is my new strategy. And then we're going to get as high as we can on each platform and go. And we have to dive, right? I think we have to. And I'm just going to hold up. I don't think you can do this fast. I thought I thought it was slippery like those like slippery maps, but I think you can just hold up, right? I don't know. Bro, I want to watch a tutorial so bad. I'm going in blind though. Okay. I think that's the strategy. You have to dive twice maybe. Oh god. Run! Whale! Move your little feet, bruh! No, no. Whale? Whale? I'm sorry I insulted you. Your feet? Can you stand up? Hello? Little bro. Little bro! Pick up your feet! Dang it! Why are you doing this to me? Stand up, stand up, stand up. He stood up and then... Stop, stop. Thank you. I'm gonna have a heart attack. Keep running. Thank you. God, bro. Why do you keep diving? I didn't dive. And on that note, let's react to someone who actually could beat the level. I want to give a huge shout out to H3 for letting us react to his gameplay. His link will be down below and definitely go subscribe to his channel. He does speak in Spanish, so I have the audio muted because I don't understand what he's saying. But I'm sure it's great. Anyway, as you can see, he's shown us how to uh, get past this obstacle. So let's take notes. So I think he's talking about the timing of it all. But as you will notice, he goes from platform to platform the same way I did. So I'm curious how he does this last one. So he didn't go fast. Okay, I just did it way too fast. That's literally it. Okay, I felt the worst possible point. I'm just going to say that because it was near nothing. But let's see the lava portion. It looks like obsidian, but we got volcanic rock. Let's see, where does he go from here? We obviously have not played this part for ourselves, but in a different video, I promise that we'll beat it. But I, I, I literally can't. I have to catch a flight in less than 24 hours, and we got to make a video, and I want to showcase the whole map to you guys. But it's basically like Lava Rush, and then there's a few trampoline points. You know what? Let's make it a bit faster. Sorry, H3. You're being a little slow. Why not? Just speed run. Come on. I know you can do it. Okay, so it's looking pretty similar to what we've seen already. But from here, it's just like a log. You can slip down. And then from there, is he stuck? Wait, did he get stuck? He had to reset because of that? Wait, that's wild. 
Dang. Okay, so now he reset and he's all the way back. Um, now getting to that point, what does he do? So from here, go straight. He got stuck again? Wait, where can you go? Oh, you can go over there. He literally just figured that out as he was playing. Pro tip. Ooh, and now you have like a space themed and then you have like the honey drop tiles. Do they drop from under you? Okay, they don't. That's at least nice. So small trampolines. This part seems really easy from here. Um, okay, then there's a single trampoline that you have to jump on. Let's see it. Go for it. Oh, he can't make it from without diving. So he has to dive there. And perfect. Well done. Oh, he basically has like a rock wall. How do you get up it? Oh, you have to send yourself? Wait, that's so cool. No. Oh, I would get so mad. I would get so mad. I'm so glad we're reacting to this part. Again, huge shout out to him. Definitely go watch his video. If it were me, I would try to get as close to each of those platforms because I think he's going about it a bit wrong. Yep, there you go. Okay, now he has one more hammer. <gasps> oh, I'm nervous for him. Obviously, he beats it, but 18 minutes in. Oh, wow. Okay, he finally got it. Sending it. Oh, and now he's to the final part. Wait, is that the end? Oh, <gasps> he just beat Stumble Up. I believe he was the first to do it. I might be completely wrong, but huge shout out to H3. Definitely go check out his video. He beat it in 10 minutes. So we will definitely have to make a full video and beat it for ourselves. After falling at that part, I, I, I just couldn't do it. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys use code Baby Yoda, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.